Hey you guys, it's me, Mickey Muffin, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I have the huge pleasure to stand here with Rocco Sifredi. <laughs> How are oh, you? Hello, Mickey. Bene, bene. All good. <laughs> when was the last time you were in Switzerland? Ah, quite a long time ago, maybe four or five years ago. Last time I was on the... I don't know if I was in Zurich mm -hmm. or in Basel. Zurich, maybe, no? Yeah. It was Zurich. You remember better than me. <laughs> maybe also for the Ecstasia, right? Yeah. Oh, nice. I have one huge question, like, do you remember your very first shooting you ever had? Of course. How can I forget? How was that it? It was the dream of my life. How was it? You want to know the truth? Yes. I went to the bathroom. Yeah. And I did masturbate two times yeah. because I was afraid I would come too fast. Yeah. And I did come too fast anyway after masturbation. Oh, no. So to me it was <laughs> like go into the paradise because I never went. I remember I was in Paris. Belle d'Amour is the movie. Yeah. Mark Dorsel, the producer. Michel Rico, the director, was one Austrian girls and some French girls. I had to work with a girl from Austria, yeah. blue eyes, brunette, beautiful. But when they introduced me to her, she was with high heels, with stockings, and I never see the girl like this before in my life. So I said, what? What? So I went to the bathroom, yeah. I did it, come back, and still, still didn't go too, too well. <laughs> did you do it with condom in France? No, no. Oh, we are okay. talking about 40 years ago. <laughs> All right. Uh, do you miss these times when you were first shooting and were inexperienced? How was it for you? Like, do you think no, back no, at it? No, no, no. It's not because to be a professional, you needed to, to go through this. Yeah. But uh, the best, if you want to know which one was the best time for porn for me, 90s. Just a few years after. I started 85. Yes. And uh, from 91, 1991, yeah. the best porn ever until end of 90s. Then we became the future, which good and bad. Um, what changed for you the most in the last 10 years? Like, what do you see? The most uh, people get less interest about what I love the most, sex. Mm -hmm. So most of the time, girls and boys, they just look about many other things than sex before the scene. Uh -huh. And that's for me a little pity. Yeah. There is few girls and few people who are still interested. But most of them, they just look them Facebook, them Instagram, how much like they have. Okay. And that's to me, it's a little bit like being there without being there. Uh, yeah, I get that. Because back in the days, you didn't have the social media. So no. you were shooting with people no. you like. And you, you like, learn yeah. many things. Yes. And you can be more human. Yeah. And you can be more connected. Yes. Today, people have sex without connection, even though they don't need connection. So they go like, OK, let's do it. But I'm old and I follow with my old style, which means I understand the words go in one direction but at least I want to just feel something. Yeah. Did you always felt a disconnection to your shooting partner? I could never get hard without. <laughs> oh, I get I, 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 di I didn't use nothing. Today, most of the actors, they have yeah, tricks. <laughs> yeah. They have tricks. Yes, let's call it tricks. <laughs> oh, so you were always like natural. Always. Of I could, growth. well, you have to understand that on the 80s, there was nothing. Yeah. 90, nothing. Mm -hmm. Things start to come after the 2000. Yeah. We don't want to make publicity, but you know, pills. Yeah. Now it's much more than pills. So now anybody can be a porn star. That's what I say also, yes. <laughs> yeah, now it's for everyone. But still, even just because it's for everyone, you should know what you're doing exactly. because easily you can hurt girl because if you don't need that feeling you can just stick everywhere and that's not so good you have to know i think can i tell you something sex is the only art you cannot act you can act anything but when it goes to sex if you don't have feeling you can see you want to know what they tell me people fan around the world they tell me all the same thing. Hey man, it looks like you like what you do. Yeah. And this is a secret. Yeah, there is no more secret. Yeah, that's why you're my idol, because I really like your style of shooting and it looks so passionate and it's really wow. And um, what was one shooting that really stuck with you? What is the most memorable one? Oh, there is many. <laughs> if I want to say, probably the shooting I had with uh, 
John Stagliano, Batman, Fashionistas, Round the World, so many good souvenirs. Mm -hmm. uh, shooting head with Kelly Stafford, which wa was probably my best connection girl. We, me and her, I would see her like me as a femme, a okay. woman. So it's like me and her always trying to surprise each other. Mm -hmm. Or uh, also, I have to say, how can I forget when I meet my wife, bodyguard? So, you know, those kind of uh, movies for sure are forever in my brain. But I have to say also any movie, because my way of thinking is every day you can get something new. Yeah. How did you feel at your very last shooting? Did you feel sad or were no. you excited? No. No, because I stopped three times and three times I go back. So, <laughs> so, so last time, uh, what I did, I said, I hope it's the last for real. Because you have to know that I suffered very much mm -hmm. eye addiction to yeah. sex, yeah. which goes in the natural way. Because if you do sex every day, every day, every day, every day, yeah. two times, yeah. and you decide to stop, mm -hmm. He will probably say, hey, man, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> you want to stop me? No. And your and wife's that's, like, no, please. And, that, and that's the main problem for real, uh -huh. which now it's a joke, but to me was very heavy because I was going out with anything okay. just for this. And the last time I stopped, it was this time for real or for, and I think it was, I think it was for real because, okay. because it's been, Most two years, no, no more movies, and no prostitute, oh. nothing. So I'm oh, fine. <laughs> um, how does someone qualify for your academy? What? How does someone qualify for Opus Freddy Academy? It's complicated. It's complicated. Now we are building up a um, platform, yeah. a learning platform for real. And from the platform, we will do also course yeah. in Budapest. Yeah. But the problem is I cannot do it for a thousand people. Yeah. And I have a thousand people who write to me. It's not easy. Yeah. But I made my first academy, woman academy. And that was, I have to tell you, yeah. was the most interesting in the good and the bad. Because with the boys, they all want to fuck. They all come for this. Girls, ah. <laughs> Well, it's complicated. Many girls, they just want to become famous. Yeah, that's a problem. And, and then once they are there, they don't want to do nothing. So yeah. to me, it was challenging to show the girls mm -hmm. we cannot achieve nothing without the efforts. Exactly. Uh, the world goes in one direction when everybody wants to become famous without doing nothing yeah. or small efforts. Yeah. Uh, this is really difficult situation. I, I always say there is no shortcut. You really have to work your butt off to get somewhere. There I is know. no fast I way. Know. Know. No fast way. Yeah. Uh, I shot at your academy once in Budapest and it's amazing. It's so wonderful and you have so many animals there. So I really... Oh, you made a tour. <laughs> I made a tour, yes. And um, yeah. I won't hold up any longer of your precious time. Thank you very much that you took the time for the interview and I hope I see you again. <laughs> Soon. Soon, hopefully. Super muffin. <laughs> Thank you. Super muffin. Yes. <laughs> I want to eat one muffin today. No, I'm oh. kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Is this a comeback? <laughs> ah, yes, yes. Grazie mille. Thank Ciao. you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Grazie. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video till the end. If you liked it, leave a thumbs up. And also, if you want to see more videos like this, you can subscribe to my channel. Also, here you can find my latest video and here you can see the rest of my channel. Also, if you want to follow me on social media, it's linked in the description below. And also, not just my social media, but also my very private videos. Mwah, till next time.